Hey yo everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am here with another kind of shop with me video. We are at Walmart. What baby? Did you say we were doing a shop with me? <laughs> <laughs> we're at Walmart today. I want to just kind of look around see what they have. I'm also looking for stuff for possibly some stocking stuffers or gifts for people. I am also kind of looking for things for a Christmas party that I'm hosting with other moms. <laughs> so if I can find some like cute little Christmas knickknack decor things and like plates and cups and stuff like that for the party that would be phenomenal. But yeah we're gonna do some walking around and some shopping and I want to take you guys along. Let's get into it. All right, little babies. Y'all, I just realized I don't have my wallet, so <laughs> I hope Walmart takes Apple Pay because we don't have anything. If not, then I guess we'll just be walking around today. Okay, what? Walmart has a dollar section. I have never seen this, and I've been into this Walmart a few times. These would be so cute little stocking stuffers. So they have a notebook and pin set, a little zebra on a skateboard. We'll circle the pterodactyls. Draw your favorite dinosaur below. All this looks to be a dollar. They have this triceratops on the skateboard. Draw a scene in the snow globe. How cute. Word search. They have a bunch of slime. Yeah, baby. We got chocolates. Marshmallows. Marshmallows and chocolate. We have Play-Doh and they have slime. These are $3. Look at these little Christmas ornament craft kits. These are $5. And they have little clay ornament ones. Whoa, mom, Maybe is in heaven right now. I love now. it. You love it. Do not take Apple Pay, you guys. So we're just gonna be doing some window shopping and then I will come back. We got these little shrink me's. I don't understand that, but it comes with instructions. So I'm sure we could figure it out if we got it. They have gloves and hats. All of these are $5. These aren't bad. These would be good stocking stuffers. Different colors, really nice gift box sets. Two pieces, they have different prints. Look at these signs. How cute. With the different greens. Oh, I like this gift box set. That one's cute. Oh, and this one. They have gift bags. Oh, you get a ton in here. Five pieces. And look how adorable the prints are. Oh my gosh. Walmart. Yeah, I'm definitely coming back for these because they're all different sizes too. That's really good. Navy likes these little stocking holder houses. Mm -hmm. These are heavy. I thought they were gonna be light and not worth it, but these are heavy. And they have like a natural color that is a different shape right there. You could paint these. If you wanted to get these and you didn't like the natural wood, you could paint them. Look at these signs for five. I'm obsessed right now. They did not have this at all during the Halloween time. This one says welcome with a little snowflake. I think those are the only two. The wine bags. Here's another gift bag set Mom, with more neutral colors. I know, isn't that cute? Yeah, I'm definitely coming back for these. These would be perfect for like soup nights filled with cheer. Those are only $3. They have these mugs, so very merry, and then they have these soup bowls. So I don't see the red ones in a mug, just the green ones. Not having nails on is killing me right now. Put a candle in there, a little tea light candle. Oh my goodness. I am just amazed right now. It makes me so happy. Does this belong here? Felt bucket, $5. It's the only one I see of this. It might be in the wrong spot. And you could put gifts in there. So it could be kind of like a double gift. Little trees. What is that? Like a decanter? A food safe, yeah, decanter. Cute. There's no top to it though. Decor kit, some fuzzy socks. They got more up there. Oh, I like the little candy cane looking ones. It's trees. These aren't part of the dollar section. I mean, they're over here, but they're $15. I like those little mugs. You like these? 
it says? It's a sign. It says, let it snow. So <laughs> oh my gosh, there's just so much like wood decor. These little houses are adorable. I love the blue. Hey yo. <laughs> A nutcracker. They have these little advent calendars. What is that? A dollar or three? Oh, that's five dollars. It's a little much, I feel like, for the material, but it's cute. Oh, they have a car with a pink tree on it. So this would be cute. You could put like bath bombs and like bath essentials in there. Use that as a gift. Navy's loving this right here. A little food. Oh, what do I want? Um, I'll take the tacos, please. <laughs> right here. You like that? Yeah. That's cute. Uh, so I'm not seeing a price. Oh, twenty dollars. Here's some more mugs. Look at the pink Santa. How cute. They also have a red one. Oh, these are nice. The fa la la la. And I'm seeing a pink one. Oh, it's broken. I almost cut myself. <laughs> Is that so, Imran? Oh, here's one with the handle. There, look how cute. Be careful, it's breakable. They have these for a dollar, little paint, wood things, Santa, polar bear, the reindeer. I like the glitter on the scarves. A throw blanket right there, and then they also have pillows in green, white, and orange. Now they have like dishes, like baking casserole dishes. That almost fell, it scared me. Whoa. $5, Walmart. Baking dishes? They have this one too. Y'all know I'm not a big fan of Disney stuff, like as far as decor, but this is cute. Merry and bright, happy holidays. All for me, I do like that. And they have little cookie cutters and spatulas for Minnie and Mickey. Oh, look at these cutting boards. Oh my gosh. You wanna have this? I can't buy it right now. I don't have my wallet. That was the biggest fail on my part. They're two-sided. These are cute. They have the matching towels. I actually really like the Pluto one. The color of it is pretty. You get two of them. For five, and then here's the Mickey one. <laughs> Amron likes the towels. A sun catcher. Oh, I didn't see any more of these. Are they all gone? This little Santa Claus wax warmer. It has a pink hat. What you smacking your lips for? Let's see. What kind do I want for the party? I kind of like the gnome for the holidays one. Those are big plates though. Let it snow. I'll have to come back for the party. Table covers. Definitely gonna need one of those. What's for me? Oh, thank you so much. These are cute. I like those. That's the kind of matching table cover for that. Well. <laughs> Some ideas, something for me to think about. A drawing, gift bag. Let's go here. Found something that would be cute for the party. These light up jumbo ornaments. Nine dollars. I could get like two of these, two or three. Hopefully they'll still be here tomorrow when I come back. I cannot believe I forgot my wallet. It was in my gym bag and normally I keep my gym bag in the car, but I was like, no, let me remove it. Forgot to put it in my diaper bag. And then I think I might get a couple of these because these are only $2. They have a snowman and a Santa Claus balloon. So those would work. So squishy. Definitely want to get this too, I think. Tassel garland. Do they have more options? What's this in here? Hanging danglers. That would be cute on the, over the dining table. Oh, and here's a banner. Oh, I like the tree garland too. So many options. 
Here are some of the gummies. That one's kind of open, but the Christmas gummies. Y'all remember for the kids' birthday party? I got those spider gummies for the top of their cupcakes. Those gummies were delicious. They were a huge hit at the party. So I'll probably get some of these. I wasn't expecting them to be good. I just thought they were cute for the cupcake tops and decorations, but everyone was like, these are really good. And I tasted them and I had about five myself because they were delicious. So if you ever see these kind of like sweet shop or holiday gummies, at Walmart, just get some for parties or whatever. They're delicious, I promise you. The little Christmas sprinkles are cute too. They have different ones. They have this one, which I like. A stacking tower. Look at these towels. These are pretty for 96 cents. You only get one, but I like the designs. They got more plates. These might be better because they're not as big. I like the gnomes, not gonna lie. Plastic ones, these are cute. The snowman or the Santa Claus. I love these napkins. Little sippies for the kids. Is this a gingerbread? What is this? Oh, a reindeer. That's cute. Then we got Santa love these and I'd get these for the party but they're seven dollars a piece <laughs> but they're cute it'd be nice for the kids like on Christmas Eve or if you even wanted to put Santa's milk in there this is cute I don't see a top for it I don't think it belongs here it's glass there's no top I'm sure there's more somewhere they got Jack I can't remember her name for the life of me right now What's her name? Oh my gosh. I watch this movie every year. Sally, right? Yeah, Sally, I'm pretty sure. They have small ones. Look at the little gingerbread. <laughs> She's going for the Barbie. Oh, she got sidetracked by the Play-Doh. Play-Doh takes precedence over Barbie, apparently. Not her grabbing all the colors. <laughs> What is this, a bluey box set? So just two books in there. I am surprised that this big illustrated Nutcracker book is only $5. And the print is so nice on it. Look, <laughs> it ran... look at that. For $5, this is actually the book my parents have and the book my dad reads to us every Christmas Eve. We would sit on his lap and he would read us this book. I'm about to get emotional. <laughs> this one's also only $5. Uh, Harry Potter, oh, advent calendar for Harry Potter. So this is, this is $24. It's a kind of more childish version of that for $5. All right, it's the next day. We're actually at Target now. I'm gonna go back to Walmart after we go through Target, but I didn't wanna go Back to Walmart first, since I kind of showed you guys everything yesterday, I did remember my wallet this time. Nevi is snoring so badly. Oh, she has so much drool. She just finally raised up. She has so much drool. She fell asleep coloring. So she has like the marker on the paper that's open. She's done snoring now because she resituated. <laughs> okay, Imran's awake though. Not normal for like Imran to be awake. Normally all my kids fall asleep in the car. Even Kale, like if we're driving more than five minutes, typically all my kids will fall asleep in the car. I go through Target, same thing as yesterday. I also wanted to check out Target before I went back to Walmart to see if I liked anything better at Target as far as like stuff for the Christmas party goes. Usually when it comes to that stuff, I find Walmart's actually better because they have cute stuff and it's cheaper typically. But this Target might be different, so we're gonna check it out. Oh, it's so windy today. They got their calendars already out. Monthly calendar. Just kind of like simple, modern. Looks a little bit more like Christmas. Not a fan of the material of it, but I do kind of like the cardboard look. It's a bigger one of that cardboard look one. I kind of like it in the bigger style. 
with the to-do section. Kind of like that slippery material. They're not paper. It's why I think I don't like them as much. If you use a pen, it will smudge easily. And I don't like that. But they have a bigger version of the colored one, which is cute. The colored one. You what? Oh. Cute, but not my favorite calendars that they've put out before. This would be cute for a party. It's a spinner set and you create your own for like a drinking game or a game night. I've never seen the Target dollar section have a ton of ornaments like this. Oh, look at brown Santa. I love. The mouse, polar bear. You like these, huh? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Look at the house one. It's so cute. Kind of reminds me of Grinch. Yeah. It looks like all the ornaments are $3. I like the reindeer. Oh, it's so shiny. Oh. The snow globe. They also have one that says gin. Hmm? Is that the sound a triceratops makes? No, no, an elephant. An elephant? Okay, these are cute. Little camper. This car. Oh my goodness. They do have a few things for New Year's. Mylar chandelier in pink. Only seeing the pink. The banners with these different colored stars some disco balls, little martini glasses, necklaces, sunglasses, for these little shot, champagne zippers. <laughs> I do like this. It's a big ass straw for a big ass bottle. Let's get this party started because I want to go to bed at 12.01. <laughs> That's me. I don't think I even stayed up for New Year's last year, to be honest, you guys. Look at those glasses. Those are cute. I wish I had some of these for like Christmas time because I would get them. Little flute. At this gifting station, they have these pretty hair clips in pink, like a royal blue, and then like a sky blue. This cloud iridescent looking one with the rhinestones. My nails look so busted. I'm embarrassed. I'm gonna put new nails on soon. <laughs> Maybe you're dancing. Oh, look at this cute set. I love the rhinestone one. Got socks, a bag. I like this material, the puffy. These bags are cute. This is more like a olivey green, like a dark olive. <laughs> you dancing? Is there a mirror? Yeah. Oh, that's why. <laughs> I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> a little like jewelry case so they have all this in blue and it also comes with like sweaters but the blue one comes with this really nice jacket i like the material and i love the color this bag is a little different with the green one it was like fuzzy and this one's like the faux leather and it's black this blue one is so pretty a few the options are all different the green one had more purses and this one has more makeup or jewelry storage. And then they have it in pink, which also comes with the jacket. It's a bit different material than the blue one. And then it has different hair clips as opposed to the other two colors with the barrettes. Or you can get the big clip. I don't really see any purses for the pink except for this little clutch here. I have pink. And they I have, pink. have that in black. I have pink. That is pink. I know you love pink. Some monogrammed journals. I don't need any of this stuff, but I've never really looked at Target's party section and this stuff is really cute. To the moon, like the napkins. They have let's celebrate. Have party favors. Party decor for totally jawsome. <laughs> the shark plates, the dinosaurs are so cute. Look at all that. I've never really seen this section before. Or I have seen it and it's never been this cute. This little superhero one. I'm obsessed. We'll definitely remember this. 
They have a balloon decor kit also. Garland, banners, not garland. Oh yeah, garland. It's a surprise. No, stop adding stuff to the cart. We are not getting any of this, honey. I love you, but no. Amy's obsessed with unicorns, so she picked this stuff out. <laughs> For just as cute stuff in the future. You like that? Yeah. We're not buying that. It's a purse. It's a purse? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even notice the bigger plates down there with the tablecloths. Look at that. I didn't even see all that. Oh my God, look at the Eeyore with the Christmas outfit on. Obsessed, obsessed. Oh my gosh, how cute. Baby Yoda. So I'm looking at the baby snacks because Imran's starting to eat more actual food now. So these keep calm in cardamom, apples and cardamom. They have mango and basil, strawberries and balsamic. This one threw me. This one definitely threw me. Roasted red peppers, sunflower oil, and sea salt. I'm like, I kind of want to get them for her to try because it's so much different than like the normal. Same for these puffs. They got strawberry, basil, apples, and broccoli. I got maybe wanted apples and broccoli, so I picked that up. And then I also picked up this carrot and broccoli because Navy wanted that too. She loves carrots and broccoli. I haven't really ventured over to this section of the Target. It's not a super Target, so I didn't know how much they would have, but I just smelled this. This is the first time I've smelled the vanilla bean and hyaluronic. It smells so good, it would be perfect for winter. I love, love Beauty and Planet. This one always smells good. The white peach and aloe vera smells delicious. They have a watermelon one. It's not here, but I'm obsessed with the watermelon one. Okay, y'all, <laughs> we are obviously back home. I had to cut that really short. Let me just explain to you guys. Got to Target after I kind of talked to you guys. I got a cart, got it all ready. Went to go grab Imran out of the cart seat and there was just shit everywhere. I mean, baby's awake now I'm sure she is she's probably gonna start crying here I she pooped she just farted <laughs> so I'm probably gonna have to deal with this again she just shit like so much and I don't know what it is with this baby I've never had this problem before it has so many blowouts a week try different diapers I tried different sizes I've tried like situating differently every time she's in that car seat you guys Eight out of ten times that I put her in there, she has a massive blowout. But this one, this one really took the cake. It was, I mean, she was just covered in shit. And the car seat, disgusting. And it's like super windy. But we get there and I'm in the parking lot. She's in the trunk. I'm stripping her down. I brought, I have like a little travel cleansing water from Mistella that's in my diaper bag and wipes. I use nearly an entire pack of wipes cleaning her with that Mistella cleansing water. I got her all cleaned down. Then some of the poop like got on my car so I had to clean my car. I cleaned her car seat. I cleaned for about 37 minutes. I'm not even kidding. And I was like, I feel like this is a sign but we're just gonna go ahead and move forward because we already drove all the way over here. Imran's in a new outfit now. She's all cleaned as if she just took a bath. And we get in the store, everything's starting okay. I'm obviously filming for you guys for about 10, 15 minutes maybe. I give both the girls a snack. I'm giving Imran a pouch. And at this point, I'm kind of already like getting on the edge of overstimulation because I choose to let Navy kind of walk around now. She likes to look at things and she's constantly like showing me stuff, which is perfectly fine. I love doing that with her, but I'm also trying to film for you guys at the same time. So it can get a little much for for me but I'm doing my best to be patient and calm cool and collected and Navy's talking to me she's saying mommy 74 times a minute anyway I turn here's Imran here's the car here's Imran I'm looking at her she's doing great 
I turn this way to grab a pack of baby socks. I turn back. The pouch is literally everywhere. I'm not even kidding. That's how short of a time frame it was. I just turned. I didn't even move my full body. I just turned the upper half, grabbed the socks, came back, and it was just everywhere. Just pureed carrots covering her entire outfit it's all over the blanket it's all over the cart cover it's all over my wallet and i'm like is there a second pouch so where is all this coming from it was never ending of pureed carrots so then i'm running to the bathroom navy's pitching a screaming tantrum because i put her in the cart obviously when i saw Imran had this mess i was like we need to get in the cart so navy was not having it she was so pissed off at me and i mean just screaming and crying at the top of her lungs because you know my girl's a diva all right i never had to deal with that with kale kale was never like that in the store but navy y'all she will throw she will throw that timber tantrum and i've learned to like deal with that i handle it my way i'm not going to get into that because i don't need nobody trying to tell me how to parent get to the bathroom i try to pick Imran up as careful as possible for the best that i can to not get it on me and i'm realizing just like how much is all over everything there's a mom there she was like do you need my help and i was like i don't even know where to start it's just carrot everywhere and she was like let me help you so she helps me kind of get the girls into the bathroom she was like let's just bring the cart into the bathroom because i needed to clean the cart and everything else while also cleaning the baby stripping Emran down immediately i'm looking for wipes to kind of clean up the carrot that has dripped everywhere and I'm realizing from the first category 5 event that I dealt with in the parking lot that I left the wipes in the car but then I had to go get a new pack of wipes the mom asked if I needed her to stay and I told her like no please just go about your day thank you for helping me get everybody into the bathroom but then I realized I don't have any wipes so I have to go and get a new pack of wipes and I already changed Imran into her extra outfit so I also had to grab a new outfit for Imran and then finally I see a worker and I'm like can you please get me some plastic bags because I have so much that I need to put in there so he grabs me all these bags I am in that bathroom forever cleaning up baby food and I just I don't understand how there was so much. I Because the pouches are only like this big, you guys. After I got Imran all cleaned up, I went and checked out and bought the um, pack of wipes that I just used three-fourths of, literally. It was almost gone at this point. So I went and paid for the wipes, and then I paid for the outfit that Imran was wearing. And I was like, let's just go. We do not need to continue. Obviously, we shouldn't have even came in here. <laughs> But I didn't want the trip to be a waste, but I literally drove 25 minutes just to clean up shit and pureed carrots. Oh, and to top it off, you guys, I just told y'all my distress drink is Dr. Pepper. And Whataburger is right there. So I was like, let's just go get a drink so I can calm down on the ride home. I got me a Dr. Pepper. I got Navy a drink for her. As soon as I turned out of the parking lot from Whataburger, Navy spilled her entire drink in the car. So that's just sitting back there on the floor of my car. And I'm just like, I'm just dreading going back there. Don't even understand what just happened today. Anyway, I have nothing to show and I am so sorry, but I hope you guys like what I showed in the walkthrough. Emran's obviously getting cranky now, so I'm gonna go. I love you guys. I have to go back to the store tomorrow because I didn't get anything that I needed to get for this weekend for the Christmas party. So maybe we'll try again tomorrow. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.